Hello, I'm Sig Solo. Welcome to my channel. Today is Jazz 7, or just Saturday Shave number 7. And as you might have seen in the thumbnail, I have a brass razor for you. The Charcoal Everyday Brass Razor. Here you have it. Wonderful, wonderful looking top cap. Nice looking handle. A little more machine marks that I would like to see on a racer in this price range, I would say. Um, this was uh, $210 for me delivered here in Greenland. Um, so I would say, no, $225 for me. I would have liked to have seen a handle without tool marks between the mace in here. It's called the Mace 3.0, this handle. And this is, of course, the brass head. The head looks nice. It has the same loading system as the charcoal, um, the game changer. And I believe I was told the game changer was based on this, or was it the opposite, opposite way around? I don't know. Anyway, it's a little finicky to get the top cap to be straight uh, because you load the blade on the base plate and then you put the top cap on. And it sells, it says on their homepage that it is self, it's a floating, um, a floating fitting, and it when as you tighten it, it will put itself into place. It didn't for me. I had to fiddle a little around, and that's <laughs> I don't like that. Another thing, it came in this beautiful box. See, an envelope. That was the box, and then inside a plastic zip bag. That's it for $220 razor. Hmm. I would have expected it to come in the nice box like the charcoal level one, two, three, the you know the other charcoal goods razor. But that maybe that's maybe just me. Today I have the old gold from OSP Obsessive Soap Perfectionists from England and this is a dupe of the Old Spice, and I tell you, it smells wonderful. It smells like the Old Spice, not a new version of it, but the old, old one. The one that my grandfather and my father used to use when I was a child sitting at the toilet, or on the toilet, on the counter maybe even, watching them shave with their straight razors. I have a new brush bought from Darcy, second hand, in the UK. The Big Bruce Razorock, I have the Sig Solo Black Ball. And in the racer today, I have, oh, wait a minute, look at this. Look at this, man, that's nice looking. In the racer today, I have the seven o'clock black. It's all black, 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 black. That's how I try to do it. Look at the thumbnail. Tell me how, what do you think? I've tr tried to scale up my thumbnails a little to make them a little more, you know, artsy. It's not a, it's not a thing I do very good, and I'm still working on it. But tell me, what do you think? So, the old gold from OSP. This is the first time I use this brush. I just cleaned it. That's all I did. Man, that's soft. Big bruise. Oh. This is one of oh. This is a very strong soap. Mind you, I only have a sample of it. Oh, this is maybe the strongest scented um, Old Spice do I've tried. Uh, mind you, I haven't tried the one from Master Soap Creations yet. I have that in my den, but I will. But I have been contemplating doing samples because I've gotten a lot of samples over the last year. I haven't used a single one. So, I will be using samples on the uh, Saturday shaves from now on for a long time because I have more than 20 samples, maybe even 30 samples, 40 samples. Okay, the everyday, the charcoal's everyday razor. 
It's 96 grams and it has a blade, a blade gap of 0.762. Like the rifle, you know, the 308, that's a 7.6, 7.62. This is a 0.762. And this was designed to be a razor you could use every day, a mild razor. So, and I tell you, this has a nice, nice feeling to it. It's a neutral blade exposure. Not negative, not positive, but neutral. And I tell you, this is very nice. All my complaints about the box. The blade being a little fiddly to align, everything is forgiven. This is a three inch handle. I thought it looked so great in the pictures. The maze, you know, with the maze on it. So, uh, I would normally say I'm a three inch handle guy. This is very nice. Two and a half days double. And I thought, well, the seven o'clock black is one of the sharpest blades. I know that. So when I read the specs of this, I expected it to be mild. And I would say it is very mild, but efficient. And, 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 th and that's where, you know, the commotion is for people. Mild and efficient. You can have a mild razor that's very efficient. Speaking of mild and efficient razors, I just God, I noticed that my Henson Titanium Aggressive has been shipped. Uh, so I'm looking forward to getting that from Canada within the next six weeks or so, <laughs> because this is Greenland. So, second pass. Man, that's a wonderful scent. I am going to have, I have to purchase this. I really need to, man. This is the best sending. The best sending Old Spice tube. I've tried. James, you nailed this one. Mike sent me the sample like he did last Saturday. Um, so thank you, Mike. So. Oh, wrong way. Jose, wrong way. When you use <laughs> longer handles, this almost feel feels like <laughs> a travel racer. But this I know it's an expensive racer, but this is a racer I wouldn't hesitate recommending to a beginner. I know it's expensive. I would give him the choice to purchase this again. Or would you go with the four inch handle, the torpedo or the anchor?
because I like longer handles and that's 108 grams. I just did the thing you cannot do, applied too much pressure right here. I think I caught myself. Not the racer's fault, my fault. As is always the case with me, you know, when you have a mild racer, Six Soto, it's the man that cuts himself with it. Well, this is very nice. Light on this soap is excellent. I feel absolutely no skin irritation or anything. Sometimes you can feel a little during the shave and you know you have been you now over shaving. That's not how I feel now. I feel wonderful. Maybe this is an everyday shaver. Not that I shave every day. This is Greenland, as you may know. So I need to watch out for my skin. My skin cannot handle shaving every day. I have tried. I tried doing just one pass to be able to shave every day, but I did that for a week. But I felt that I hadn't shaved at all. You know, you feel the stubble. You get used to the feeling after two and a half pass. Look at this soap. This is a nice brush, the big bruise. I believe it's 26 millimeters. Okay. So I was go I was about to do a half pass, but. You know, what the hell? This razor is so nice feeling. I haven't seen that many YouTubers use this. I've seen Colin. Use it at some point. And I believe that's about it. Why that is, I have no idea. Maybe because they, they have the charcoal goods, the one with the levels. Maybe they do. This is a wonderful. Wonderful racer. So Did you buy anything? From the Black Friday or Cyber Monday? What's that? Well, this I felt. This is just some bumps that I get. It's not the racer. It's just me showing you that even a mild racer will bite you. All right. So in case you didn't know, kind of my trademark to take a ride, a mild racer, and then cut myself. So, okay, 
get ready for the captain to speak. We are about to land. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain speaking. Sit down, fasten your seatbelt, put your table into an upright position, and wash your face with the face cloth. Oh, yeah. Ah. That's just fantastic. Oh yeah, into the ear, another trademark. Up the nose, you know. Oh, that's wonderful. That's wonderful. So I will be using a sa um, sample on next Saturday. I haven't decided on which. I have a whole box this size with samples in it. So the aftershave for today is the one called Old Spice. Of course. How could I not use that? I feel a little here. That's it. That quickly went away. And then, you know, put the rest on the sleeve. You want the scent to stay here. I saw to you, fat boy. He had seen my video and he recommended doing this last week. So, Jew fat boy, you're welcome. <laughs> oh, yeah. Finally, the Nivea men. I don't want the scent from the, this soap to be gone. I don't want it to disappear. So, was that too much in my hand? Might have been. Got it on my watch now as well. Sorry. Don't mock me about mentioning you, fat boy. I'm sure you've said the one, said the thing with the, with the collar for years and I just haven't seen it. It doesn't matter. I'm just making, just making a little fun here. Okay. Please let, let it be. Let's go. Okay. So, let me just rinse my hands. Someone in the family has been in my Nivea Men because it's almost empty and I know I didn't need it like that. But that's okay, boys or girls. The razor for today. The charcoal, charcoal everyday razor, brass, with the 3.0 maze handle, 3 inch. In it, I had the Gillette 7 o'clock black, super platinum. The soap for today was a sample sent to me. Oh, I just made it wet. Sorry. A sample of OSP gold, old gold. Soap sent to me by Mark. The rate of... The brush for today was Big Bruce that I bought from a gentleman in the UK called Darcy. Thank you, Darcy. And the ball for today was the Six Solo, the black one. Aftershave Splash was the Old Spice, of course. Cream, Nivea and Blue. Okay. Like. Subscribe, hit the bell, and share, and comment. And again, let me just mention again, if your comment is not shown, I didn't delete it. If I don't answer your comment, it's because it was never shown. You can be sure of that. I have the AACD, always answer comments disorder. You know that. So make sure that it's there if you wonder why didn't he answer me, because I always do. Okay. Why do we do this? We do this because we are not obsessed. We are, we are dedicated. Six Solo, out.